Hope you don't get tired of this back. I need to move the product out of the way. <laughs> Hello there, fellow hikers. Hope you don't get tired of this background behind me, but I really love filming outside, hearing the birds chirp. Love hearing this creek. Me and my son, I've got a campsite set out here for me and him, so we can come in our backyard. Feel like we're part of nature with this creek running. It's awesome, I really enjoy it. We hang our hammocks just back here and have a good night's rest listening to the creek. If the neighbor's dog's not barking. So I purchased the olive drive wide asymmetrical tarp from Dutchware gear i'll put a description down below where you can check out his website he's got a video on his website from his youtube channel i highly recommend you check out his youtube channel so you can see all of his gear but i'll put a description like i said down there so you can check it out i highly recommend all of dutch's products uh, dutch is the man so we ought to call him dutch man instead of Dutch wear, but he's got all the wear and all the gizmos. Some people call it gizmos, but the bling. But I... We're just going to tear into this thing. And watch stuff fly out. <laughs> Okay, I'm pretty excited about this. Uh, I got a new tarp for my dream hammock, as you can tell from the title. And it uh, comes with a couple lines here. I've got the black reflectant line and the zingot line. Uh, because I ordered my wife a dream hammock, I got her some Tyvek to go underneath it. And this is the asymmetrical tarp. comes folded instead of stuffed. It's a doubled in stuff sack. I'll probably be making some snake skins for it. Uh, I've really come accustomed to snake skins. And this is the wide argon asymmetrical tarp. comes with these little D-rings here. I got it in dark olive dry off. And for a detailed uh, setup of this, you can check out Dutch's website. He's got a video on there, or check out his YouTube channel. I'll put the descriptions down below so you'll find them easily okay we've got everything in the stuff sack that came with it we've got the all of the line that's included the dutch stingers and we're going to weigh that now we've got 13.7 ounces so this was weighed with the line that come as a package deal that you can order i also had purchased some shock cord as another alternative because I've used shock cords on a lot of my other tarps as a continuous length versus a little small length. I actually use a longer length. I've come accustomed to that because Hennessy uses that on the monsoon tarps. And I really love the ability to just pull it, clip it with a mitten hook. And you'll see that in my review, if you watch my review of the monsoon, how it's real simplified, no knots, no, no gadgets, just because it's shock cord, you just pull it clip it with the mitten hook right into the stake and then basically set your stakes where you want them unhook the mitten hook throw the tarp over and if you get a little drizzle or it starts to come down like cats and dogs just take it out run it to the stake clip the mitten hook on it it's it's a pretty awesome system but i do got some uh tarp worms coming for my wife's new tarp so we're going to pull everything out of the stuff sack and see what we've got in here We've got the tarp obviously, not hooked the lines up yet, but we have the black reflective cord that he offers. 
We have some zingot with Dutch stingers. I ordered two mitten hooks, and basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hook this cord. I actually got four of these, but I'm only gonna use two for this tarp. And you, you're gonna hook this onto here. This other end's going to go down to the stake with this hook to this hook here. I'm gonna run this out to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna run this one out to the tarp keep this one always attached to the stake and run my stake run my line unhook this because it has a it basically has a hook so I can unhook it and once I unhook it pull my tart back and when it starts to drizzle I can run this back hook it onto the tart and my stakes are already there lines are already set just waiting to be hooked uh, that's another reason I probably might use the shock cord. Either way, I'll probably use shock cord. It gives me that little bit of flex and adjustability so I can hook and unhook. And I had a, for the other side, because this is not with a continuous loop. And uh, if you check out his website, he explains exactly why these are better to use than uh, using a continuous loop because he the, the ridge line on this is adjustable you can unclip this move the tarp clip this back on basically use one Hennessy snake skin, not Dutch approved, but works very well. You take one snake skin and I found that one snake skin, it comes with two, but one will work on every tarp I've had so far.